Hi friends, how are you? By blessings to the God, you are doing well. Uh, this is Dr. Arthundu Jaina, faculty member, PG Department of Business Management, Pokemon University, Bass of Behar, Balasur, Odisha. So once again, I am welcoming to all of you to Dr. A.V. Jaina classes. On my, uh, on my dear uh, students friends request, so I have prepared this video. And today, uh, friends, uh, we are going to discuss the venture capital financing. And this is uh, the very, very um, useful and fruitful, not only from the uh, academic point of view, but also from the exemption point of view. So from the academic point of view, the, so this discussion will be very, very useful and fruitful uh, to the UG and PG students so far as the commerce management, PMR and other related subjects as well as. So this discussion will be very, very useful and fruitful those who are preparing for the UGC net and JRF as well as the lectureship exemption and other similar types of exams. So friends, without delay, we will start our academic journey. So friends, so I will have the request to all of you kindly don't skip this video from beginning to end. I mean the last day, you see, you watch it and you will know more and more and you will be uh, very much comfortable in your uh, uh, academic exemption as well as in competitive exam. So dear friends, Without delay, we'll start our discussion and the discussion is uh, concerned with the venture capital financing. Yes. So, venture capital. So, venture capital, friends, venture capital is the combination of, it's the combination of two words. Combination of uh, two words, that is the venture and capital. So venture capital in mathematical equation, venture capital is equal to venture plus capital. Friends, so we have to know what is the meaning of venture and what is the meaning of capital. So venture means that is the risk or the danger of a loss or the possibility of a loss. So capital means we know the resources uh, which are required to start a business or an enterprise. enterprise. So venture capital. now. So, uh, this diagram, friends, you see, so individuals, so banks and the financial institutions, so they will act as the venture capitalist. It may be the individuals or the group of individuals or banks or it may be the group of banks and other financial institutions. And so, uh, they will pull the fund. This fund is known as the venture capital fund. So individuals or the banks or the financial institutions, so they will they will act as the venture capitalist. Venture capitalist, venture capitalist at last we will discuss. So some the reputed or the some uh, names of the venture capitalist. So they are providing the venture capital to the uh, business. Uh, particularly to the startup companies or the medium or small scale business organization. Um, then, so what happens? So, so normally the venture capitalist will provide the finance to the startup companies or the new business. Friends, uh, without us now, we will discuss what is the uh, definitions of a venture capital. Venture capital, so VC stands for venture capital may be defined as uh, long-term investment. So it's a long-term investment in business which has the potential. I mean the business has the potential. I mean the opportunity or the scope or credential for the significant growth and financial return. Again, I'm repeating the venture capital may be defined as the long-term investment in business which has the potential uh, for significant growth and financial return. Another the definitions of, uh, of the venture capital, it is a long-term risk capital. As we have already discussed, that is the venture means that is the risk capital. Finance high technology projects which involves the risk, which involves the risk, but at the same time has the strong potential for growth. Strong potential of growth means here that is the financial return and uh, the in future so you see the uh, share prices of the new company or the value of the firm will be more and more. So next, 
what are the important features of venture capital important uh, important or the key features of venture capital so first one is venture capital is normally provided mainly in the form of a equity fund or equity capital to the uh, young companies or the new entrepreneur then the investment is made in a new business or the startup companies or during the discussion on the definitions of a venture capital we have already discussed and uh, another feature or the important feature of venture capital is new technology normally is used to produce the new product uh, the venture capital is a the high risk projects and venture capital aims or the, the aim of or objective of the venture capital is to uh, generate the or get the higher return friends so there is a say in the that is uh, there is um, in business language uh, high risk high return if the risk is high definitely the, there will be the higher return next uh, one feature venture capital is based on close contact to safeguard the investment because you see that is the long term project also the investment is a, that is the huge amount so venture capital keeps the close contact over the business uh, venture capital investment is not liquid in short term short period yes so venture capital investment is done for normally for the long period so uh, next one it's the gestation period i mean the output or the return on uh, is a uh, having with the longer period it may be more than 10 years or it may be the 15 years or 20 years so uh, that's why it's uh, the investment into or the gestation period i mean the output or the return uh, is uh, having with uh, in, in the uh, in a long run then uh, what are the stages of a venture capital financing so these are the stages so there are normally two stages early stage of financing and the later stage of financing so uh, friends so we will discuss one by one so uh, in early stage of financing so these are the capitals are normally being by, provided by venture capitalist first one is it's the seed capital then start of finance then the second round finance in later stage of financing so these are expansion uh, finance, then replacement finance, then the term around, then last one is it's the buy up friends. So we will discuss one by one. So first, uh, let's discuss the early stage of financing. Early stage of financing. In early stage of financing, first one is that is the seed capital. The seed capital is uh, provided by the venture capitalist, venture capitalist to the on the startup companies or the young companies so seed of capital so far the seed, uh, seed capital is concerned the concept and ideas of the business uh, the startup companies or the youth companies or the medium or small scale business organization concepts and ideas uh, will be taken into consideration the concept and ideas of business are the basis for pre-commercial so before production or before commer commercialization it's a the product on a research project so research project will be taken into consideration then second uh, uh, so these things will be vital so these things will be taken into consideration entrepreneurs track record i mean the startup companies or the youth companies or the the entrepreneurs track record previous experience in similar product and technology and market so these will be taken into consideration before providing the seed capital by the venture capitalist then the managerial and the production efficiency will also be taken into consideration then the real uh, realistic future of projections of the present plan will be taken into consideration by taking into consideration so these things then the seed capital or i mean the venture capitalist will provide the seed capital to the startup companies or the new companies or the youth companies or the small and medium scale business organization then second uh, in the, the second uh, one is it is the startup capital after providing the seed capital then the venture capitalist will provide the startup capital to so startup capital uh, startup capital are also very very 
vital and important to the startup companies or the young company. The innovative concept is materialized into production. I mean the concept and ideas will be uh, uh, will be materialized into commercial production. Then the startup uh, the startup capital is needed uh, or needs finance for the product development and the market penetration market penetration. So say startup capital is must uh, for the product development as well as for the market penetration. So next then in the third round after the seed capital um, startup then the second round finance the second round financing is also most of the entrepreneur entrepreneur that is the startup companies or the, uh, the youth companies uh, may need the second round finance either because of negative or the positive results so venture capital it's a the risk capital so in in this situation the entrepreneur entrepreneur uh, will need the second round finance either because of negative or the positive reason so now we will discuss what are the positive reasons and what are the negative reasons so negative reasons negative reasons as we know the gestation period and its return uh, will be available uh, in, uh, uh, will be available or the entrepreneur will will wait the will uh, wait to get the return for the longer period so there is an overrun of time and a cost and the negative earnings negative earnings means it's the loss in either startup stage then the debt is greater than the equity debt is greater than the equity then the difficulty in funding the new investors to provide the funds so, so these are the negative reasons so that's why uh, the entrepreneur will need the second round financing now the positive reasons definitely so uh, the positive reason uh, reason is a growing business and fund is required for a business expansion so for positive reasons definitely the entrepreneur will be happy and will need uh, the fund for its growth and development as well as for the business expansion uh, so in this situation both the negative reasons as well as the positive reasons the entrepreneur will need the second round financing i mean the venture capitalist will provide the second round financing to the entrepreneur um, to overcome the or to solve the or to overcome the negative reasons as well as to expand its a business now we will discuss the the later, uh, lateral stage of financing so here the venture uh, venture capitalist will provide the expansion finance in which conditions the here the entrepreneur will purchase the new equipment or plant or machinery friends you uh, friends you know the equipment cost plant and machinery cost of huh, are the, or the so these assets or equipment plants and machinery cost is that is the huge so in this situation or in this condition the entrepreneur will need the fund the venture capitalist will provide the fund to the entrepreneur I mean the to the new companies or the uh, small or medium scale business organization so that the entrepreneur will purchase the new equipment or plant and machinery. Then the entrepreneur will diversify the product or product line. Product or product line. Then the entrepreneur will also expand the market. When the entrepreneur will expand the market, the entrepreneur will need the fund will need the fund and the venture capitalist will provide the fund to the entrepreneur to expand the market. Then the entrepreneur will strength the distribution channel. So distribution channel will play in the vital role so that the final product will be uh, will be transported from the producing place to consuming place. And the settlement of a existing debt. Settlement of a existing debt uh, so existing debt the entrepreneur will need the um, need the finance to settlement i mean to redeem or to repay the existing debt then 
entrepreneur will need also or require the replacement uh, replacement finance i mean the venture capitalist will provide the uh, the finance for the replacement the venture capital the venture the venture capital purchase the venture capital purchase the shares from the existing shareholder of the company who are willing to exit from the company friends so after the after the the return from the startup companies or the new companies then the venture capital the venture capital will, will uh, or will exit from the company and the uh, venture capitalist will sell the shares in the uh, in the i mean the capital market or uh, in a, in the higher price i mean the in the premium and the venture capitalist the venture capital is a uh, required or uh, the venture capital uh, venture capital is not uh, to earn the profit but the aim of the venture capital is venture capital is to appreciate or uh, to create the more wealth then turn around in this situation the entrepreneur will need the fund i mean the finance when a company is operating at a loss at a loss after crossing the early stage and entering into the commercial production then it may plan to bring it may plan to bring about a change in its operation so in this situation the venture capitalist will uh, provide the fund to the entrepreneur and the entrepreneur will require the fund or will get the fund from the venture capitalist okay to change its change its operations or the business plan in order to uh, get the or i mean to uh, avoid i mean uh, to avoid the loss or and to get the profit then uh, the uh, entrepreneur will mod will modernize and expand its operation addition to its existing products or the deletion of the loss making products i mean the the products the products who uh, which gives which give the loss to the entrepreneur the entrepreneur will delete i mean discard the product from its product line and uh, the existing products uh, may be uh, may be modified so in this situation the entrepreneur will need the fund or the finance the venture capitalist will provide the finance to the entrepreneur then uh the entrepreneur recognizes its staff staff or undertaking aggressive marketing of its product aggressive uh, aggressive marketing of the product so in this situation the venture capitalist uh, uh will provide the fund to the entrepreneur i mean the entrepreneur will get the fund or finance from the venture capitalist for the purpose of aggressive marketing of its product i mean it's a, so there will be the more discount or uh, other rebate and other uh, the commissions will be given to the sales persons yes so next time the uh, last uh, last uh, one in the lateral stage of venture capital financing it's the buy out deals buy out deals the venture capital will provide or provide the finance for the buy out deals buy out deals but it's so a management buy out buy out mbo mbo stands for it's the management buy out management buy out which involves or mbo involves the company's management team company's management team combining the resources to acquire all or part of the company they manage another the meaning of mbo is mbo it is a type of acquisition where a group led by people in the current management of a company buy out majority of the shares from the existing shareholders and take control of the company friends so it's a very very vital what is the meaning of or concept of mbo uh, friends you have to remember it so mbo involves the company's management team combining the resources to acquire all part of the companies so they manage yes so now the modes of venture capital financing so these are uh, 
these are the uh, modes of venture capital financing. So its the first one is its the ordinary shares, then the debt instruments, then uh, its uh, the conditional loans. In debt instruments, conditional loans, what is this? The no interest rate. Uh, as lower rate of uh, interest or no payment uh, peri pe pe periods are prescribed. So here, that is, uh, it's uh, the no interest or the lower uh, rate of interest and uh, no payment of uh, periods are prescribed. It's uh, known as, that is the conditional loans. Then the convertible loans, convertible loans. So it's, uh, that is the, the this, the debt instruments will be converted into, that is the equity bond, I mean the equity share. Then next one, you see the conventional loan. What is this? So these loans are the usual term loans carrying a specified rate of interest are repayable in instrument over the number of years. Conventional loans, I am again repeating. So these loans are the usual term loans carrying a specified rate of interest and are repayable in instrument over a number of years. Then it's also income notes. It's another mode of uh, venture capital financing. What is this? So it is the combination of uh, both the that is the condition uh, that is the uh, that is the uh, con uh, con convertible loans and the so it's the typological error. It's a, that is it's a friends. It's the convertible loans and the conventional loan conventional loans both the interest and the royalties are paid at a lower rate to the venture capitalist so these are the modes of uh, venture capital financing again i am repeating ordinary shares uh, and uh, uh, debt instrument uh, conditional loans convertible loans con conventional loans and income loans income so it's a that is the uh, error in typing it's a that is the convertible loans. Now, we will discuss what are the importance or benefits of venture capital. So, so these are the benefits. So, first benefit or importance to the entrepreneur or the startup or the young company. So, venture, capi venture capital venture capital fills the gap, the owner's fund. So, normally the venture capital uh, so normally it is in the form of a owner's, equity, owner's fund or equity fund. Then venture capital fills also the working capital requirements, working capital requirements. Venture capital also helps to recruit the professionally qualified and skilled personnel to carry out the production and the management smoothly. Uh, next, uh, what are the benefits, I mean the advantage to the investors? Uh, to the investors, since the investors invest only after the company starts the earning the profit, earning the profit. So in this situation, the investor will get the benefits, will get the benefits. Then the risk is less and it ensures the healthy growth of the capital market. So normally, so these benefits are available to the investors. Then. Uh, uh, to the economy, to the economy, so venture capital provides the finance to explore the vast unutilized potential and talents. Venture capital provides the finance to explore the vast uh, unutilized potential and the talents. Venture capital also provides the entrepreneurship and fosters the growth of uh, entrepreneurs. Venture capital also helps to grow the industrial development industrial development. So far as uh, the develop, developing country India is concerned, then venture capital also provides the technological development and friends, the technological or technology plays in a vital role not only from the, uh, the natural person's uh, point of view but also from the artificial person's uh, point of view. Then venture capital generates the employment to solve the problem of uh, em on employment, the problems of uh, that is the employment so far as uh, that is the uh, India, uh, the youths of India are concerned. So after getting your degree, then you may get the employment in uh, the 
स्टार्ट अफ कंपनी और द न्यू न्यू कंपनी और द यूथ कंपनी सो द यूथ एजुकेटेड यूथ गेट द एम्प्लयमेंट सो वेंचर कैपिटल विल सॉल्व द दैट इज द एम्प्लयमेंट रिलेटेड प्रॉब्लम देन नाउ व्हाट आर द डिसएडवांटेजेस ऑफ द प्रॉब्लम्स ऑफ वेंचर कैपिटल फाइनेंसिंग सो दीज आर द इन्वेस्टर्स बिकम द पार्ट ऑफ द ओनर सो हियर द इन्वेस्टर्स बिकम द पार्ट ऑफ द ओनर एंड द ऑटोनोमी एंड द कंट्रोल मे बी अफेक्टेड of the startup companies or the new companies or the youth company so it is that is the venture ga venture capital it it is a, it is a lengthy and a complex process so far as the venture capital financing is concerned next the venture capital financing it is that is a, the high risk project and uh, the gestation period of a startup mm. companies or the new company or youth company is a longer period and the risks and uncertainties are more in that is the start up companies or the new companies or the youth companies then venture capital financing is having a the with the huge investment so these are the major or the main disadvantages or the problems so far as the venture capital financing is a concern friends now we will discuss the last part of our discussion who are the venture capitalist i mean the venture Uh, the venture capital funds in india the venture capital venture capital funds in india venture capital funds in india so first one all india financial institution so all india all india financial institutions uh, uh it's a ifci venture venture capital funds then idbi venture capital funds then ic icai venture funds managed company limited then sidbi 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 venture capital limited then come to the state level state level financial institutions state level financial institution so they are the gujarat venture uh, venture finance limited then andhra pradesh industrial development venture capital limited etc then commercial banks also commercial banks so they are providing the venture capital to the startup companies or the new companies or the youth companies uh, sbi sbi state bank of india venture capital fund then can bank venture capital fund then indian investment funds etc uh, so uh, so they are the commercial banks then the private sector venture capital uh, funds so uh, are also available to the start up companies or the new companies or youth companies so they are that is uh, the credit capital venture capital fund india limited then 20th century venture, venture capital corporation uh, limited etc then the also the venture capitalist or the venture capitalist or the foreign venture capital funds or venture capital so they are asl partners then matrix partners then the soft bank capital uh, soft bank capital etc so these are or they are the venture capitalist i mean the venture uh, capital funds are available from the all india financial institution state level financial institution then commercial banks private sector private sector venture capital capitalist then the venture capital foreign venture capital so they are providing or they normally or they do provide the finance to the startup or the new companies ah uh, so dear friends so these are all about today's discussion so during the discussion uh, any gap or the mismatch uh, you find kindly you give your available idea suggestion in the comment sections uh, i am hopeful that you have learned a lot um, so i will have the request to all of you kindly kindly you subscribe my channel kindly you share it kindly you forward it i am waiting your available comments for the next video uh, next video and your available suggestions and the comments are most welcome for the next video uh, once again thanks a lot to all of you